the eyes have been traditionally called the window to the soul and that's for a good reason because uh, pupil, blink intensity, it, it all has affective and cognitive information. Eyes have been used for biometrics for some time, but one University of Missouri, Kansas City researcher has developed ways to revolutionize the process. The idea was to put the burden of good biometric scans on the computer rather than the user. For example, starting with, uh, with ocular scans. Iris scans are very well known, but for a ir good iris scan you have to be very close to the camera, you have to look straight into the camera, and so forth. So if you're looking to the left or to the right, you have an off-angle iris shot, and the iris is occluded, so you cannot um, do the identification. So I thought, well, um, how about using the other part of the eye that nobody's using, the white of the eye? And, you know, being an engineer, uh, I did not know much about eyes, so I started uh, looking around, and uh, I should uh, also uh, mention my good colleague, Dr. Rohit Krishna from UMKC and Sabatis Eye Center, who helped me out here. And first of all, the microcirculation that is on the white part of the eye is actually inside a thin transparent uh, layer called conjunctiva. And that's vasculature like any other vasculature uh, in your body. It's very, very unique. Even uh, identical twins will not have the same vasculature. Even if you clone someone, you know, to, with the same exact genetic information, you will have a differently developed vasculature. So that's how unique it is. So it's as good as or even better fingerprints. By developing software to use low-cost basic equipment, this new technology from UMKC will not be limited to high-end security. When you think about biometrics, it's instantly, you know, uh, mission impossible type of scenarios. Uh, I imagine and hope that most applications for biometrics would be for, you know, private citizens. And when you, for example, want to log into your computer, um, e-commerce and healthcare, avoiding a lot of fraud uh, when it comes to, let's say, online banking, online shopping, and uh, healthcare fraud. Uh, that biometrics could be a uh, big uh, economical engine.